Alright, so today we are going to take a look at Tekenu, Obelisk of the Sun by Danielle Tashini and David Turksey. Alright, so let's take a look and see what we have inside. So I'm going to go ahead and flip it over and see the back side of the box and we'll open up the shrink wrap here. And we'll get into it. So let's open this up, see what we have on the inside here. All right, we got a bunch of pieces here with the silica gel stuff in there. I hate that stuff, I don't know why that's in there. I guess it's just to keep things nice and dry. But we've got a lot of pieces, so let's take a look at some of these pieces here. All right, so we've got these different, it looks like little columns here. Um, of different colors. So, nice little plasticky pieces there. So, I like that. That looks good. Plenty of dice and different colors. So, we'll just take those out. Those look like pretty standard dice. Nothing crazy there, but a few different colors there. Alright, and then it looks like we've got some of these smaller cards, so let's kind of take this off and see what we have here. Alright, so we're just kind of looking at these. Anything on the other side? Yes, there is. So let's flip this over here. Alright, so let's see what we have. Not real sure exactly what they are yet. So different kind of iconography and symbols that are in here. So interested to see kind of when we do when we do our how to play video what that kind of looks like okay so just looking through there see some of these other colors so it starts to look a little bit different on that and then some of this other stuff here cool all right so there's your cards at least those and then we've got a few other pieces here Let's see if we can figure out what these are. Not entirely sure what that shape is. I'm sure we'll figure that out down the road. And then we've got some little baby meeples, it looks like. Some little, little very tiny, tiny meeples there. Oh, they're so cute. <laughs> All right, and then looks like maybe some score markers or something like that in that bag. And then let's open this up and see if we can figure out what this bag contains. Looks like all the shapes are the same. Um, not sure again what the shape is, but we'll figure that out when we do the uh, do the how to play. And then just some small cubes. And then some bigger meeples. So we've got the, uh, the baby meeples and the bigger meeples. Alright, so you can kind of see the difference there inside. All right, so let's open some of this up. So here's some, some cards. It looks like the uh, turn instructions. So player, uh, player turn cards and things of that sort. And then I guess dice affinity, I guess what the dice can allow you to do. And we got a basic black bag. Uh, we'll see what goes in there when we do the how to play. All right, let's take a quick look at the rule book here. Actually, before we do that, we've got a literal obelisk that we will set out, I believe, in the center of the board somewhere. So we'll take a look and see how that works out. So let's look through the rule book here for a second. All right, so we've got a list of all the components. Still looking at components, then we've got the setup. This looks like it's laid out pretty nicely. Okay, kind of working through, then it tells you about how to play. Moving through all the different actions that you take. A lot of rules here, but it looks like it's laid out well. Okay, there's a solo mode. Okay, so for those who are into the solo gaming, there is that. And then there's an appendix back here that tells you a little bit more. 
Excellent. And then a quick reference there on the back for uh, just kind of the general, I guess, how to play and all that kind of stuff. So, very cool. Alright, now we've got lots of cardboard cardboard actually uh, packaged up and, and we could, we could kind of, I'm going to let Jody kind of open those up while I pull this out. This is the board. So let's take a look at the player board, which seems to be a pretty good size. And I think we're going to go this way with it. Alright, so let's see how much everybody can see of that. And I'll try and get as much in screen as I can. There we go. And it looks like the obelisk is going to go right here in the center. Okay, that's that's pretty cool. This is this is a uh, this is a pretty cool board. There's a lot going on on here, um, and then we've got some of these cardboard with all the pieces and things like that that we can punch out. Okay, so let's kind of take a look at some of these real quick. Just kind of punch that out real fast. That felt good. That felt real good. And we've got the gold pieces here, so. Get excited about the gold. All right, excellent. And these are and these are pretty thick. This is pretty thick cardboard. It's nice and sturdy. So that that's really nice. Okay. So there is our unboxing of Takenu. You can see the board there, and here it, again is the outside of the box. That is Takenu, guys.